What's up guys, this is Kobe here. Today, I'm actually going to be bringing you episode 0. Yes, episode 0 of the complete Arcane River storyline. And now this, you know, we're going to take a little blast of the past. Uh, we're going back to a few years ago when they actually implemented this questline into the game, alright? So, this questline is about the Amnesiac Temple Keeper. If you don't know who this is, it is a dude in a hoodie the memory lane of Temple of Time who has lost his memory. So it is up to you to get his memory back. And of course, you know the reason why I'm covering this now, even though it's been out for a few years, it's it's just recap. And he plays, this dude right here plays probably one of the, he plays the biggest role in Road of Vanishing, which is episode one of my Arcane River series. So this is just episode zero. I call it episode zero because, you know, it doesn't even take place in Arcane River yet. So we're going to go ahead and get started. Basically, you see this dude, the Lost Temple Keeper, right? Like, this Temple Keeper, he's in memory lane too. He's just lost in some memory lane, like the temple. He's just, you know, chilling. And who would have thought of like a fucking Temple Keeper just, you know, getting lost in their own temple is that does that make any sense it's it's just kind of weird but then it's you got to go up to him he's like hey uh can you help me find my way back and he's just like what you don't even know your way back but you a temple keeper it's kind of like what it doesn't make any fucking sense so you tell him how to get back so he goes ahead and goes back so you probably kind of want to show him the way back a little bit but then you also want to talk to the real temple keeper about who the hell this guy is so the temple keeper he, she i believe that's a girl uh she doesn't really know who the hell this person is because she's like you're gonna ask the temple keeper temple keepers looking at you like what are you kidding me me know this person have you lost your mind but you go ahead and just ask anyway it's like you know who would know the memory keeper go ahead and talk to the memory keeper about it i'm sure he would know something you go ahead, he goes to the memory keeper, and he's like, hey, who the hell is this amnesiac temple keeper that's just stranded in the temple, and he doesn't even know his way? So he's just talking about, hey, the only way to restore the lost memories is to go back in that point of time. Like, wait, what do you mean, that point in time? The fuck, you tell, you, this guy's not from the present? I'm confused here, man. So you really go back and talk to your Mizak Temple Keeper saying, you know, asking if he's forgot everything. But he's just like, of course I have. I don't even remember my own name. Like, what? You don't remember your own name? Bruh, you're joking, right? How do you not even know your own name? You really did forget everything. So it's like, okay, so that's not going to be it. We're going to go ahead and talk to the Temple Keeper again. See if she knows anybody else. Who can bring back the amnesiac temple keeper's memory so you were told to go to the sorcerer temple keeper tells you to go to the sorcerer because she says that he can make anything happen anything so like this dude just guaranteed to bring back your memory so it's like okay if you really think that the sorcerer is gonna bring this guy's memory back then i'm gonna go ahead and listen to you i'm gonna go ahead and listen to you and i'm gonna go to the sorcerer so you go to the sorcerer, talk about, okay, so there's this dude at Temple of Time who doesn't even know who he is. So he's like, okay, I can make a potion. I can make something called a Tingle Brain Potion. With the use of this Tingle Brain Potion, I'll be able to bring the memories back of the Anesiac Temple Keeper like that. So he requires you to go ahead and kill some monsters in the frozen area. Or actually, just monks and guardians within all of Temple of Time. Uh, bring some items back, as well as one mil mesos. So you talk to, I don't even know why the hell he wanted money. Um, he's probably just like, hey, it's going to cost you some dough. Because I don't do this shit for free. You don't put money in a potion. But you know, I don't know, man. But anyway, so. You get the potion. Because it's like, yeah, I, I got the potion. I'm going to go ahead and bring it back to the Amnesiac Temple Keeper, and we're going to give it a shot. Guess what? Nothing happens. Dude drinks up the potion, and it's like, hey, was something supposed to happen here? 
Cause I I don't I don't remember anything. Uh, a little of his memories came back. He still doesn't know his name, but he doesn't really know like his purpose or all everything. It just you know it's a tiny little bit. So you talk to the old lady again, the temple keeper. Talk about hmm. There's one more person that you could talk to to help this guy out. You need to go to the record keeper. The record keeper will know who this guy is because he keeps the entire history of Maple World. He knows exactly who everybody is. Like that's kind of, that's kind of creepy, you know? Like this dude just over here stalking people. Talk about hey, um, <laughs> bro, that's nasty. <laughs> um, it, we gotta go ahead and talk to the record keeper. Record keeper comes out and says, um, he believes he lost his memories because he's lost in time. Um, let's try to think about that real quick. The amnesiac temple keeper, he lost his memories because he's lost in time. Come again? What do you mean lost in time? He told me to say those exact same words to the temple keeper. Maybe this is some sort of language that they got going across each other. He's lost in time. So you go to the temple keeper, and he's and then the temple keeper's like, "Okay, I understand what the record keeper means." I'm like, "What? What? You do? What do you mean you understand what the record keeper means?" I'm talking about he's lost in time, bro. Come on. So I had to go ahead and tell the amnesiac temple keeper, you know. This is all the help I can give you. There's really nobody else I can go to. Yet this stupid lost in time shit that the temple keeper knows about that I don't know about. And it's just like, what's what's happening, man? But then, the moment you apologize, saying sorry, I can't help you out, blah blah blah. He's like, wait, wait, wait a second. I remember everything. I remember everything. Even you. I remember you. My name is Cal. My name is Cal. I am the amnesiac temple keeper, and I am also a resident of Ellen Forest. Most of you guys wouldn't know this because he was a resident of Ellen Forest. And none of you guys ever did Ellen Forest. That's what I meant to say. <laughs> but yeah, nobody ever bothered with the Ellen Forest quest line. And that's pretty much it. So, as soon as he takes off his hoodie, he looks like you, but you're wondering, why does this dude look like me? What the hell? There must be something going on. He looks like me. He's lost in time. Who are you? Now, though his name is Cal, that's probably not his true identity. But, you know, if you want to know his true identity, I gotta be a dick and say this. You gotta wait till next week when my Road of Vanishing video comes out. Because, you know, this is episode zero. Getting all this shit hyped up and started. Like I said before, you can finish this quest on GMS right now. And it's required for the fit job advancement. So anybody that's watching this, go ahead and do it, man. Go ahead and start. And I'm telling you, we're going to learn more about so-called cow next week when we take a little trip to Road of Vanishing. Enjoy the video. Press like. Subscribe if you haven't. Well, that's only if you want to. And we'll see what goes on from here.